Hey there, viewers. Do you have a dog? If so, you'd probably do anything for it. It's hard to resist those puppy dog eyes staring at you, especially when it wants something. Yes, the love for our pets is real. The problem is we often don't realize we're hurting our dogs. In many ways, their lives hang in the balance. Let's talk six things you didn't realize are killing your dog. Are they not getting proper exercise? What's their diet like? How important are vaccines for your pet? Wait, heartworms? What are those? We're talking all that and more. Number one, heartworms. If you care about your pets, this one might be hard to wrap your head around. Did you know your pet can get worms in their heart? Disgusting, isn't it? Well, that's not even half of it. Heartworm is a disease caused by parasitic worms. It can result in lung disease, organ damage, and heart failure. The worms enter the body through mosquito bites. As the infection spreads into the animal, larvae from the mosquito begin to grow within the heart. From here, they can spread to the lungs and blood vessels. While this process happens over the span of seven months, a fully grown worm can live inside the dog for up to seven years. Heartworms can grow up to 12 inches in length. What's even scarier is that these worms will mate and spread their own larvae. At one time, your dog can have as many as 250 worms living inside of them. This sounds like a death sentence, doesn't it? Well, it can be if your dog is not treated in time. If your dog sounds like they're having trouble breathing, they need medical attention. Other symptoms include a rough and persistent cough. If the dog is tired after mild activity, this could also signal an unwanted visitor inside their heart. When you get to the vet, one way they check for heartworms is through a blood test. This will detect possible proteins that are released into the bloodstream by female worms. The best way to treat heartworms is by preventing them. There are several heartworm products being sold on the market, but they need to be prescribed by a veterinarian. This leads me to the next entry on our list. But hang on, have you ever owned a weird pet? Perhaps an exotic animal? What was its name? Sound off in the comment section and start a conversation with our bestie community. Number two, no vet visits. Much like humans, animals need checkups. If your dog is in good health, you're recommended to take them in once a year for an annual physical exam. A puppy should have their first medical exam pretty much right after you get them. During this exam, the vet will check their health and make sure they're free of any parasites. Throughout their years, they'll need to be taken in for certain types of checkups. When your dog gets into its senior years, which is usually after they turn seven, vets recommend they come in twice a year. This is because older dogs are much more vulnerable to health problems. The earlier these problems are detected, the easier they can be treated. It's also important to watch for changes in your dog's behavior. The slightest shifts may be signs of growing health problems. This includes excess salivation, breathing trouble, and increased water ingestion. If you're ignoring these signs, your dog will likely have a shorter lifespan. Number three, poor diet. This one's pretty obvious, but it still needs to be mentioned. If your dog is not eating properly, it can be life-threatening. There are plenty of poor quality dog foods out on the market that your animal should stay away from. There is no one feeding schedule for dogs. When and how much you feed them often depends on several different factors. Regardless, veterinarians recommend that you feed your dog at least twice a day. If your dog has some sort of condition, it may require a special feeding schedule. If your dog is larger than others, they'll likely require higher calories and more feedings. You also need to factor in the dog's age. This is especially crucial for puppies who are growing rapidly. Puppies need small feedings. At the same time, they need to be fed frequently. For the first few months of their lives, they will need tiny meals. Around the four month mark, they'll require three feedings a day, but not long after, they'll only need two. These feedings are to nourish the puppy through its development. It helps both their bones and organs. Not correctly feeding your dog can result in issues like loose stools, constant itchiness, lack of concentration, and ear infections. If you're unsure about how much you should feed your dog, check with a vet or animal health expert. Before we continue, are you concerned about the state of your own health? Check out our recent video discussing 11 ways to keep your blood sugar levels healthy. Now back to our list of things that can kill your dog. Number four, lack of exercise. Yes, your dog needs exercise. I'm not talking about taking them to some sort of doggy gym. This can be as simple as bringing them outside for a walk. If your dog has been inside for an extended period of time, it's gonna have a ton of energy pent up. The animal is gonna need a way to release that energy. But you can't just begin to take them out as they get older. They need to learn to be active as puppies. Since puppies are always growing, it wouldn't hurt to take them on a couple short walks throughout the day. The reason I say short walks is because longer walks are harder on them as the animal is still developing. If your puppy isn't getting the proper outdoor time, it can become destructive around the house. If your dog is older and of a high energy breed, they require much more exercise. No matter what age your dog is, they need to burn off fat just like the rest of us. Studies show that overweight dogs live two and a half years less than the average healthy canine. Number five, no vaccinations. Young dogs require several vaccinations. I'm talking about within the first few months of their life. Not doing this can leave them vulnerable to several diseases and viruses. 
Your dog needs to be protected from not only heartworm, but illnesses like canine hepatitis. This is a contagious viral infection that damages various organs. They also have to watch out for canine distemper. This is another virus that affects your dog's respiratory system and gastrointestinal tract. Have you ever heard of a kennel cough? This is an infection that happens as a result of inflammation in your dog's upper airways. Frequent vaccinations will stop your dog from getting these diseases, reducing their chances of early death. Between its first 8 to 18 weeks of life, your dog requires something called the DHPP. This is a combination vaccine that prevents four different types of virus – distemper, hepatitis, parainfluenza, and parvovirus. If you're a new dog owner, talk to your vet about which vaccinations you should be getting and when. Number 6. Improper Dental Care Plain and simple, keep your dog's teeth clean. This means brushing them on the regular. Sounds a little weird, right? Well, not if you're a responsible dog owner. While it doesn't need to be done every day, the more you clean your dog's teeth, the healthier they'll be. Giving your dogs a careful toothbrush will prevent gum disease, bad breath, tooth loss, and pain. It will also stop bacteria from taking over. On top of brushing their teeth, there are other methods. These include tooth wipes, which are rubbed against your dog's teeth to get rid of plaque. You can also use dental treats. These will contain ingredients that not only help your pet's teeth, but will have their breath smelling fresh. Cleaning their teeth only takes a few minutes. If you want your pet to be around longer, this is something you have to consider. Actually, that reminds me, have you checked your breath lately? Has your dog's health ever been in danger? What are you doing to make sure they're safe? Let us know in the comments below. We would love to hear from you. Enjoyed this video? Hit like, share, and subscribe to Bestie. Wait! What kind of Bestie are we if we don't tell you about our other awesome videos? Go ahead, choose the left or right video, and enjoy!